Born in the West Bank, Mohammed Mustafa gained his PhD in the U.S. and worked at the World Bank in Washington, as well as stints as Palestine's deputy PM and economy minister, and he's been the chairman of the Palestine Investment Fund since 2015. Managing nearly $1 billion in assets across the territories, Mustafa has been at the forefront of Gaza's reconstruction for 10 years and hopes remain that he can unify the territories, but also manage the colossal task of rebuilding the enclave, besieged after months of Israeli bombardment. We don't want to give an excuse for anyone, but I think we, we can also, the Palestinian Authority can do better in terms of uh, building better institutions, providing better governance, so that we can unite our people uh, in the next phase, so that we can reunite Gaza and the West Bank and also prepare for reconstruction of Gaza. We don't want to leave Gaza without reconstruction. It's very important we do that. And also open up a clear pathway forward toward statehood, statehood. The road ahead will require steady diplomacy and command, with much of Gaza now rubble, and over half of its 2.3 million population displaced and desperate for aid, with the West Bank too also grappling with its worst violence in recent history.